Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Far Cry 6 on a Far Cry Friday. I'm your host, Colors Fade. It's episode 43. We have a big mission coming up here with Anton in the city proper, which I don't think is any coincidence that it reminds me quite a bit of playing Half-Life 2 and the way that city center is set up as well with the various checkpoints and blockading of streets. Anyway, it's going to be real fun to get to that part. For right now, let's dive right in. Okay. Mice. That's how you do it. Uh, martial law is in effect. This they really have this town set up as is quite the maze. You people coming in here and harassing my folks. We will have a free Yara. What is this? Spray paint? Oh, it's a little baseball. Engineer The sun's coming up over Yara. Operation nearby. I have an operation this in that mob. Heard you got a spot on the night shift. Stephen King's The Night Shift. Rule number 23. If you have a chance to cut the head off the tyrant, you'll fucking take it. Yes, you do. Which is why, Juan, I shot McKay. All right. The gorilla hideout. Uh, now, let's see. Yeah, what Paradise Lost. Right there. Oh, fun. Taller. How are you guys I don't doing? Know you. Where is Clara? Clara Garcia. Where are you doing? Let's make sure we're all charged up. Impact boots. We place explosives here, here, and here. Speed starts, charges detonate. We create a ring of fire around that hotel hotter than the devil's asshole. Which means? Castillo's forces can get out and reinforcements can get in. With Danny right in the middle. And then what? Danny kills El Presidente. It's beautiful. Hey, Danny. Danny! Look at that sexy Supremo! You want me to kill Anton Castillo? Today? Anton is giving his annual Independence Day speech at the Hotel Paraiso. Live. 
Juan has intel on the exact location of his security detail. One in a million opportunity. We're gonna cut the head off the snake and make boots from his skin. Mierda. And you good with this? Kill a dictator who has raped our land and turned our people into slaves? Thinking about it. What about you? Never killed the president before? <laughs> it's an assassination, Danny! It's guerrilla meth! Christ, I need a shower. And you need this. You're gonna be a fucking guerrilla legend! I call you! <laughs> He's too excited. I'm already a legend. He's right. Kill Castillo and Libertad will rise in the chaos. And after that, who knows? Who knows? Go put that come mierda down. Viva Libertad. I like this plan. Place it, plant explosives at the checkpoints. <clears throat> okay. Well. the explosives at checkpoints find the generators they pop real nice okay okay how do i trigger them you don't clara and i have guerrillas out planting bombs all over esperanza it will be a semtex symphony you're on the tuba and i am the conductor vamos danny the binga i can't keep up with your metaphors <laughs> <laughs> all right where are they located at Wait a minute, why am I here? Why is the map there? Okay, I'm pointed in the right direction. That's what I wanted to know. Let's get to that one first. Revolution is this virus. It infects our youth, transforming them from healthy patriots into animals and murderers. It spreads to our institutions. Our culture, our life, our violence. <laughs> Oh, my pain. Special forces. Okay, careful, Danny. This is what I was curious about is how much guns blazing should I do? Because how many chances am I going to get to replenish my supplies? Because you got to be fully stacked when you go in to take Castillo. So there's some supplies. So where did he say there's a generator? Right there. Right there. Too easy. Boom boom. You wanna have a little boom boom? Fake yacht and content. So the next one is going to be where? Right here. Up the street, turn left. And we can go down through the sewers if we need to. Which it looks like we might have to because there is... Well, we need to go down here and turn right. You don't have time to yell for your partners. How do I get in there? I gotta go around here. Some fireworks for our anniversary. Now there are... There's a gun up here. Maybe up there. That is a lie. It's always funny when you hear liars say the word lie. It, it's like they, the word doesn't fit. They can't fit it in their mouth. What do we have here? Nothing? 
It's gonna be down in the building then. There is the weapon. What do we get from this? Ooh, crackle and pop light machine gun. Second charge ready. Moving to a higher ground. Yeah, take that, son of a bitch. Oh, there we go. What do we have here? Try calling for backup now, you bastards. You can get the high ground. But I'm gonna shoot you when you do. Okay, he's done. There's a tank. Buenas noches. Hey, you two guys are done. There's the one right there. Okay. Oh, well, I'm just going to take the hit there. Aren't I? Until it's too late. Okay, now what? Juan, the packages have been dropped off. You sound like a fucking postman. Just say A1, I planted the bombs. I sent <laughs> you a photo of where you can find me. On my way. I'm on the rooftops in front of the hotel. If you forget what I'm like, just look for the father figure you always wish you had. <laughs> I think you mean drunk uncle, Juan. Hey, I'm drunk sick uncle. Of sober. Don't jinx it. All right, we got to go there. Oh, geez. Okay. Yeah, and it's hmm, what's going to be the way to do this? Go back down this way. Can we take a right there? It is with a heavy heart that I share this news. The next election must continue. Or is the sewer is going to be the easiest way to do this? Okay, so there's... I remember this. This gets really hairy. These guys keep coming at you non-stop, so... They really want you to keep moving through here and not hole up and try to take guys out because the guys will just keep coming in waves. They'll just... They will not stop. But I will continue to uphold this promise. If I am El Presidente, you are El Presidente. So I'm not going to make the mistakes of the past. I'm just going to keep moving. Doggy's gonna run. Good job, dude. Thanks. Excellent. Excellent news. Let's go down here. Hard work. Discipline. Getting close to one. Where is one? Oh, one's over here. Okay. I like that there was that blue paint there. Would not have noticed it otherwise. You're going to die. Juan. You're going to die. Bombs are in place, Juan. Yours were the last. Can you feel it? That moment of serenity before a lot of assholes are going to die. Time for my three favorite words. Trigger the explosives. PTSD for everyone. Go, Danny. Secure the hotel and kill Anton. <laughs> Okay, this has not gone well. I've made two attempts already. Oh. Hmm. 
This is really the only way to do it to first get in here. Just gotta do this. Need to kill everyone? For future generations. Now, Can't be that simple. That I have the same dreams from my own son, Diego. I finally understand what he meant. You elected me to rebuild paradise. And now you, my true Yaras, are delivering on that vision. The draft to rebuild paradise is a great success. We are producing a cancer treatment the world is desperate for. The demand for Vivino has never been high. We have already begun to construct a capital city that embraces our past but looks to the future. We have found a path to paradise. And yet once again, another so-called revolution, another group of terroristas, Another pack it's of probably too close to me. Libertad is nothing but a cancer from the who want to burn everything we've built to the ground. The stakes are much higher. For the fake Yarns are not just a threat to me or you. They are a threat to Yarns' very survival. When you elected me, you elected the truth. Second chances. Yara must produce Viviro. And only Viviro. More Viviro than ever before. And if we allow these terroristas. Executive elevator key. There is only one. Yes, please. Where are the rest of these guys? Failure. Collapse. Poverty and our own destruction. Where are these gangoons? So it is that Yara is in this state of emergency. I promise you this. These fake yarns may spread chaos, confusion, and violence. I will be right here with you to defend Yarn. To defend Paradise. Okay. No matter the cost. Time to catch that elevator. And to those fake yarns. You have to call me tyrant, despot, dictator. I. Yes. Let's take him out. 
Except, like I said earlier, this doesn't go the way you thought it was going to go. With Danny, what's happening? a Are you twist. Inside? I'm inside. Do you see <laughs> Anton? Danny! There's nobody here. Clara, I think the speech was a recording. It's a setup. Anton's soldiers are coming for you. Get out of there. You were the one who got me on that boat. You should be dead. I was the lucky one. What's your name? Danny, and you? You know who I am. You're here to kill my father. Last I checked, you were trying to get the fuck away from your papa. I shouldn't have done that. Why? Because you were the lucky one. He's a monster, Diego. He was raised that way. And you won't be? You're not going to kill me! Depends if you fire that thing again. <laughs> if I run, he finds me. If he finds me, Yaren gets hurt. Don't you get it? He'll never let me leave. How old are you again? Do you have family? No. You looking for one, Chamaco? You should leave Yara. He won't stop till all of you are gone. Mierda. Keep your head down. This way. Fucking dictators. Gracias. Hey, Danny. My papa is sick. That's why he's not here. That scene and others like it in the game are reasons why I just can't really understand why people bang on this game because it's it's so good. What do we have here? Oh, the reloading of goodies. Thank you. Okay. Go on, oh, you. Right. She's beautiful. Don't mind if I do, Castillo. Let's go for the big show. right at it there are a couple times in the game when that happens and I don't understand why no 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 Jesus, Danny. Oh god, the car is no good. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna die getting out of here. You're supposed to just get in the car and drive away, but I thought I could do it a little differently and that's not the case. so we can shoot down this damn tank. God. 
Could you not get hit with fire every two seconds? Jeez. Also, I don't like that their tanks fire way faster than I can actually fire that tank. Okay, um... See if we can do this the way they want us to do it. Coño, she's beautiful. Don't mind if I do, Castillo. Oh, for Christ's sake. I don't even care now. So, it's amazing because in the span of about 60 seconds, the game goes from me loving it to me hating it. Lara, I made it out in one piece. Danny, are you okay? What happened? It was a setup. Nobody in there but Anton's bodyguards. We didn't get Castillo, but we did some damage to his regime. Damage? You put Anton's regime in the balls today. Hey. You ever hear anything about Castillo being sick? No, why? Uh, I overheard some guards. Hmm. It's good intel. I'll be in touch. Every step we take gets us closer to a free era. Now go buy yourself a cerveza. You earned it. So, what I didn't like about that is, that scene is incredible with the kid, Diego. That's a great scene. And then, he gives us a secret way out with a really fancy car. We're supposed to get Castillo's car. And instead, there's a bazillion enemies waiting for you to come out. That makes no sense. So I just don't like that part about it. I don't know why they needed to do that. Just let us take the car and get away. There was no need to stack that with the million enemies there waiting for us. Like they knew we were going to come out of the secret hidey hole. That was just, it's one of the few, and I mean very few, missteps that the game took in terms of tone and tactics. Because the tone of the scene right before then, when she barges in that room and finds out that it is a recording and Diego's there, that is a fantastic scene. And I love it. And then we get this dumb really stupid setup shooting fish in a barrel kind of thing so I'm disappointed by that but it's really one of the only only times in the game that I was disappointed by anything folks I'm going to end it here we're inching towards the finish line so thank you for watching and as always if you dig it give it a thumbs up I'll see you next time happy gaming everyone <laughs>